Hello, <clears throat> here we are in another room uh, with a couple of paintings I made about the afterlife. Uh, this is one of the first. Uh, it took me three and a half to four months to make it. <clears throat> you see in the right lower corner uh, the afterlife with uh, heads which represent reincarnation. Uh, they go higher and higher to the higher spheres. Uh, the man with the beam out of his light stands for someone uh, with his inner beauty uh, because uh, from the third sphere to the four highest spheres you, you can only get there through the afterlife. The man in the middle represents evolution <coughs> for the human soul. Uh, the tree stands for reincarnation cycles and you see a small round um, through the subconsciousness back to the earth again and so on and so on until you uh, and your reincarnation cycle and the man in the left corner that's uh, Christ for all the teachings he gave us um, <clears throat> I made many paintings um, eventually with pastel over here you see the spheres looking out on the earth and the moon I made this one in 2013 I made two others of uh, this painting as well, that was in 2012, but I gave them away. <clears throat> Over here you see another painting I made, uh, I think it was also in 2013, also with pastel. Uh, you see someone getting out of his grave uh, in spirit and going higher and higher to the highest spheres. Uh, the masks represent uh, the inner beauty of the spheres. So at the right you see someone from the lower spheres, uh, normal spheres and the highest spheres. Uh, with the earth and the highest spheres uh, there is before going to a new planet. Um, I have different kinds of work. Uh, over here <coughs> ah, you see a reflection. Uh, a twin soul uh, going from the afterlife close to the home of Christ. Uh, because we have many planets and cosmic rays where we will go to <clears throat> and eventually we'll go to another, another planet with our twin soul. Um, I like this one as well. In the earth uh, below uh, going to the spheres and then after the seven light spheres the souls move on to new planets. Uh, I didn't like this one at first, but it turned out great, well. You see the highest spheres over here, looking out at the moon and the earth, with the tree and its aura, and the, the cross of Christ. Over here you see a painting with the subconsciousness and the twin soul flower. Uh, they have the same colors. And uh, I made an eye with the universe and a path that is leading to the seven highest spheres. Uh, you see small houses and they represent uh, the spheres in a way until you go to the highest sphere. I also made a bigger one, uh, a couple of others as well, but that's not inside of this room. Uh, you see the earth with the seven spheres, a tree of life with the waterfall flowing uh, over. Uh, surrounding the spheres. Over here you see a twin flower soul as well, a bit differently, and twin souls who are waiting uh, and each going to the new planet after the Earth. Uh, I painted a lot, <coughs> of drew a lot actually. Over here you see uh, another painting with the tree of life inside of a human uh, and out of his mouth uh, there is a stream of uh, the universe going through the yeah on the subconsciousness with the three pyramids which I believe represent uh, for the uh, for the for the heaven in a way um, others as well over here you see a family going from the high spheres 
Yeah, to a new planet. So that's about it. I do have other uh, a couple of drawings I will show you. Uh, these are from 2003. Uh, I drew a lot with pen. Just a couple of them. You can also watch my other movies, which is in the map from uh, the paintings I made. So, a small introduction. <clears throat> uh, I will tell uh, some stories next time. Uh, so, but it gives me something to do, and I really enjoy drawing and painting. Uh, sometimes I have a, a period that I don't draw at all. At the moment, it's yeah one and a half year ago since I last drew. But before that, I even had a couple of years that I made twelve paintings in within one year. Uh, so maybe uh, I will continue with it again in the future, uh, since I love to draw and write. So that's it for today. I'll see you next time. And hope you have a great one. Uh, this is the biggest. I, ma I made another painting, which is bigger, but uh, I didn't finish it. So, goodbye. Bye.